السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ویلکم ٹو سائی ٹیک اردو چینل کلاس نائن کیمسٹری یونٹ نمبر ون از نیچر آف سائنس ان کیمسٹری اینڈ کوشچن از ان سرکل دا کریکٹ آنسر یور فسٹ ایم سی کیوز از وچ برانچ آف کیمسٹری از دا اسٹڈی آف ایلیمنٹس اینڈ دیئر کمپاؤنڈس ایکسیپٹ فار آرگینک کمپاؤنڈس اینڈ دا آپشن نمبر اے از فزیکل کیمسٹری آپشن نمبر بی از آرگینک کیمسٹری آپشن نمبر سی از ان آرگینک کیمسٹری and option number d is geochemistry and your correct answer is option number c which is inorganic chemistry and next question number 2 is which branch of chemistry helps to protect water that has been poisoned by soil option number a is environmental chemistry option number b is organic chemistry option number c is inorganic chemistry option number d is geochemistry and the correct answer is option number a which is environmental chemistry Next question is which area of chemistry improves to gauge the behavior of pollutants and develop techniques for pollution control option number a is analytical chemistry option number b is organic chemistry option number c is environmental chemistry and option number d is geochemistry and the correct answer is option number c which is environmental chemistry next question number 4 is the branch of chemistry that helps to treat diseases organic and to synthesize new medicines option number a is physical option number b is organic option number c is inorganic and option number d is environmental and the correct answer is option number b which is organic next question number is 5 is the branch of science helps to understand chemical products and processes that reduce the use of hazardous substances Option number A is analytical chemistry option number B is physical chemistry option number C is green chemistry and option number D is astrochemistry and the correct answer is option number C which is green chemistry next question number 6 is to identify the concentration of a particular solution through titration is and application of option number A is astrochemistry option number b is analytical chemistry option number c is geochemistry and option number d is organic chemistry and the correct answer is option number b which is analytical chemistry next question number 7 is the batteries in our vehicles are built on the principle of electrochemistry it is the application of option number a is astrochemistry option number b is analytical chemistry option number c is organic chemistry and option number d is physical chemistry and the correct answer is option number b which is analytical chemistry next question number 8 is the branch of chemistry that is concerned with the large scale production of chemical substances is option number a is industrial chemistry option number b physical option number c inorganic and option number d is environmental chemistry and the correct answer is option number a which is called industrial chemistry next question number 9 is the branch of chemistry that focuses on the study of polymers their types properties uses is called option number a is industrial chemistry option number number b is polymer chemistry option number c is organic and option number d is astrochemistry and the correct answer is option number b which is polymer chemistry next question number 10 is the study of interaction between drugs and biological targets as well as the developments of new medicinal agents option number a is organic option number b is medicinal option number c is inorganic and option number d is environmental chemistry and the correct answer is option number b which is medicinal chemistry your next chapter is matter and the first mcqs of the matter is anything that has mass and occupies space is called option number a liquid option number b gas option number c solid and option number d is matter and the correct answer is option number d matter next question number 2 is following our state of matter gas liquid solid or all of these and the correct answer will be the all of these and next question number 3 is macroscopic properties or properties that can be visualized by option number a is naked eye option number b is microscope option number c is electron microscope and option number d is telescope 
and the correct answer is option number A, which is neck I. Next question number four is matter can be described by both its option number A, a physical properties and chemical properties. Option number B, a physical properties and option number C, a chemical properties. And the correct answer is option number A, which is physical properties and chemical properties. Next question is a substance formed when two or more different combined chemically. Option number A, atom. Option B, compound. Option number C is element. And option number D is compound. And the option number D is solution. And the correct answer is option number B, compound. Your next chapter number 3 is atomic structure. And the first MCQ is chlorine has two isotopes, both of which have option number A, have same mass number, option number B, same number of neutron, option number C, different number of protons, and option number D is same number of electrons. And the correct answer is option number D, which is same number of electrons. Next question number 2 is number of neutron in M with atomic number 13 and mass number 27 are option number A is 13, option number B is 14, option number C is 27, and option number D is 15. And the correct answer is option number B, which is 14. Next question number 3 is which isotope is commonly used to eradicate cancer cell? Option number A is iodine. 123, option number B is carbon 14, option number C is cobalt 60 and option number D is iodine 131 and the correct answer is option number C which is cobalt 60. Next question number 4 is M shell has a sub shells, option number A is 1s, 2s, option number B is 2s, 2p, option number C is 3s, 3p, 3d and option number D is 1s, 2s and 3s and the correct answer is option number C which is 3s, 3p and 3d. Next question number 5 is a subshell that can accommodate 6 electron is called option number A is S, option number B is D, option number C is P and option number D is F and the correct answer is option number C which is called P subshell. Option num question number 6 is sodium with atomic number 11 has electronic configuration of. Next there are 4 options of which are options A, B, C and D. And the correct answer is option number D. 1S2, 2S2, 2P6 and 3S1. Next question number 7 is which of the following statement is not correct about isotopes. Option number A is they have same atomic number. Option number B is they have same number of protons. Option number C is they have same chemical properties. And option number D is they have same physical properties. And the correct answer is option number D. They have, they have same physical properties. Which is not correct about isotopes. Above three options are correct about isotopes. Next question number 8 is which isotope is used in nuclear reactor? Option number A is uranium 234, option number B is uranium 238, option number C is 235 and option number D is all of these and the correct answer is option number C, uranium 235 isotope. Next chapter number 4 is periodic table and periodic city of properties. Question number 1 is number of periods in the periodic table are option number A is 8, option number B is 7, option number C is 16, option number D is 5 and the correct answer is option number B which is 7. Next question number 2 is which of the following group contain alkaline earth metals? Option number A have 1A, option number B have 2A, option number C have 7A, option number D, yeah, 8A. And the correct answer is option number B, 2A. Next question number 3 is, which of the following elements belong to the 8A? Option number A is sodium, option number B is magnesium, option number C is bromine, option number D is xenon. And, and the correct answer is option number D, XC, which is called xenon. Next option number 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इज मेन ग्रुप एलिमेंट आर अरेज इन डैश ग्रुप ऑप्शन नंबर ए इज सिक्स ऑप्शन नंबर बी इज सेवन ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज एट एंड ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज टेन एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर फोर विच इज सी एंड द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी विच इज एट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव इज पीरियड नंबर ऑफ द एल्यूमिनियम विद एटॉमिक नंबर थर्टीन एंड मैथ नंबर ट्वेंटी सेवन इज ऑप्शन नंबर ए है वन ऑप्शन नंबर बी है टू ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज थ्री एंड ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज फोर एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर सी विच इज थ्री नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स इज बैलेंस शेल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फ़िगरेशन ऑफ एन एलिमेंट एम विच हैज अटोमिक नंबर फोर्टीन इज आगे चार आपके पास ऑप्शन दिए गए हैं इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फिग्रेशन की और करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन नंबर डी विच इज थ्री एस टू एंड थ्री पी टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन इज विच ऑफ फॉलोइंग एलिमेंट यू एक्सपेक्ट टू हैव ग्रेटर शील्डिंग इफेक्ट ऑप्शन नंबर ए इज लिथियम ऑप्शन नंबर बी इज सोडियम ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज पोटाशियम एंड ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज रिबेडियम एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर डी और बी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर एट इज एल यू मूव फ्रॉम राइट टू लेफ्ट अक्रॉस द पीरियड विच ऑफ फॉलोइंग डज नॉट इंक्रीज ऑप्शन नंबर ए है इलेक्ट्रॉनिक इलेक्ट्रॉनिकिटी ऑप्शन नंबर बी है आयनाइजेशन एनर्जी ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज न्यूक्लियर चार्ज एंड ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज शील्डिंग इफेक्ट एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर डी विच इज कॉल्ड शील्डिंग इफेक्ट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन इज ऑल ऑफ द एलिमेंट ऑफ द ग्रुप 2a are less reactive than alkali metals this is because these elements have option number a high ionization energies option number b relatively greater atomic sizes option number c similar electronic configuration and option number d is decreased nuclear charge and the correct answer is option number a it is due to high ionization energies next chapter number 5 is chemical bonding and the first mcq is which of the following atoms will form an ion of charge minus 2 option number a is atom with atomic number 12 and mass number 24 option number b is 14 atomic number with mass number 28 option number c is 8 atomic number and 8 mass number and option number d is atomic number 10 and with mass number 20 and the correct answer is option number c an atom will form an ion of charge minus 2 which have atomic number of 8 and mass number of 8 next question number 2 is which of the following atom will not form cation or anion option number a is atomic option number a is atomic number 16 option number b is atomic number 17 option number C is atomic number 18 and option number D is atomic number 19 and the correct answer is option number C atomic number 18 Next question number 3 is which of the following atom will form cation Option number A is at, with atomic mass 20 option number B is with atomic mass 18 and option number C is atomic mass 17 and option number D is atoms with atomic mass 15 and the correct answer is option number a which is 20 next question number 4 is which of the following atoms obey duplet rule option number a is o2 option number b is f2 option number c is f2 and option number d is n2 acha jahan pe b aur c jahan pe may be misprint ki wajah se jahan pe dono f2 diye gaye hain to alag jo duplet rule hai wo sirf hydrogen aur helium ये दो एलिमेंट्स ऐसे हैं जो कि डुप्लेट रूल को ओबे करते हैं तो ऑप्शन नंबर फोर में अगर यहाँ पे हाइड्रोजन या हीलियम हो तो आपने उस ऑप्शन को चूज करना होगा नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव इज सिलिकॉन बिलोंग्स टू ग्रुप फोर ए इट हैज डैश एलिमेंट इन द बैलेंस शेल ऑप्शन नंबर ए इज टू ऑप्शन नंबर बी इज थ्री एंड ऑप्शन नंबर सी इज फोर एंड ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज सिक्स and the correct answer is option number c 
which is four. Next question number six is phosphorus belongs to third period of group five A. How many electrons it needs to complete its valence shell? Option number A is two. Option number B is three. Option number C is four. And option number D is five. And the correct answer is option number B, which is three. Next question number seven is in the formation of aluminium fluoride (AlF3). Aluminium atom loses dash electrons. Option number A is one. Option number B is two. Option number C is three. And option number D is four. And the correct answer is option number C, which is three. Next question number seven is which of the following is not true about the formation of Na2S? Option number A is each sodium atom loses one electron. Option number B is sodium forms cation. Option number C is sulfur forms anions. And option number D is each sulfur atom gains one electron. And the correct answer is option number D, which is each sulfur atom gains one electron. Which is not true about the formation of Na2S. Next question number nine is identify the covalent compound. Option number A is NaCl. Option number B is MgO, which is magnesium oxide. Option number C is H2O, and option number D is Kf, potassium chloride. And the correct answer is option number C, H2O.